Okay, I'm just at the left hand side of the home, uh, closer to the left rear corner of the home, adjacent to the main toilet and main bathroom. This is the inlet to the septic tank, the tank's been emptied. Uh, as we can see the baffles are in very good condition, which is great. The inlet appears clear, um, so I'll start to work up the inlet toward the toilet. Okay, so we are holding a little bit of water here toward the inlet. And back to here where we actually have an invert that steps up or down, whichever way you look at it, to, uh, toward the uh, tank, to match the tank level. So there is a small section that does hold a little bit of water, something that may require rectification, but I believe it's of little consequence. I don't think that that was the cause of the, the actual blockage. Okay, so we have a junction here at 1.5 metres. The left side, I would assume, goes to the vent, the drain vent and straight ahead works towards the main toilet. Okay, another step up at this point. Okay, and that steps up toward the main toilet. Unfortunately, I can't work into this offset here, uh, but as far as I can tell, it appears good and clear. The, um, when I jetted, the blockage was more um, at the septic tank than here that I had to clear, so I believe this area is uh, all okay. Um, the, the drain section from the inlet is at a depth of about five to 500 millimetres, um, and it works back approximately one metre, as you, as you saw with the tape. Uh, as you saw with the recording, if if um, this was replaced, we would need to excavate down and just cut out that section from the invert through and then reseal into the tank. Uh, 